back to Boothbury. What a lovely morning. Uh, Lyndon's leading, Kev's in second and I'm not. Uh, we're just on the way to the seventh tee, it's a bit forward. It's a little bit left, I think it'll be alright. This is uh, par 5 on the court card but we're about 80 yards forward so it's quite short. Yep, that's all right, working back to the middle. Yeah. Well, if I haven't, you won't. Uh... Yeah, it is as big as the mine. Sorry. I've got egg on my face. <laughs> you have literally, literally. that. Yeah. Thankful we've spared you the JB Holmes lengthy. <laughs> Jesus. We've let three groups through, man, come on. Best all it now. Good shot. Hold on. Over the bunkers. Nope. Nope. Centre at home out these greens are for um, the weather we've had and the time of year, early March. The greens are really good. Lyndon's fourth coming in after a drop. Played it nicely, and it's a spin. Well, the matches, that bad. Three. We've got it about 162, 64 to the front. And a bit further forward. A bit heavy. Unlucky. Nice strike, Kev. Hang on there, right hand side of the green, it'll be just a fraction short. Trying a bit to draw, just a bit further right than Kev's, a bit shorter. One of his favourite shots, it loves these tricky bunker shots. It can't come out, but it did, always coming back. Good effort, I'll do it. Kev for a three. Well done, good, good three. Well, I'm trying to debate what line to take here. I think that's the right line, actually. It's just, it's a bit, it's a bit right, but it should be okay, that Pete. That's okay. It's probably a bit straight, but it's all right. About there. Yeah, that's a good shot. Well done. Careful up on this par five. Strike. There's water that runs across the fairway, but that'll be short of that. Third, probably about 100 yards. Oh, a juicy one. Lyndon's a long birdie putt. Running nicely, good pop. I'll give you that. It. Oh, okay. This is a tenth of par three, it's about 150 yards. No shots. Lovely strike, drawing to the middle of the green. Trying, well. staying out there. A bit wider than the Linden. Kev's draw this. It's me, it's not me. Oh, it's got a <laughs> lovely bounce. Wait, Let it be. Linden comfortably on the green. This for two. Oscar Bravo, that one. Oh. 
That <laughs> <laughs> definitely weren't going, God, that would like one of mine, that. Shot. Hold on. Got Kev. Kev, uh, Carol Decker's just phoned. She wants her trousers back. <laughs> Black and Decker's just phoned. What <laughs> <laughs> Third shot, it's going to be, I think, about 1.30 to the back, but looks a bit closer than that. Yeah, plugged at the back. Took dead mid apart. Well, can't move it then, can you? Kev's had too many. He lost the ball, actually, unlucky off of the tee. And Lyndon's got tree trouble, he lost the ball off the tee. He's also in the trees and he's got um, a branch behind the ball. So he says. That's a good shot. For right! Twelve T well forward is about two fifty. Kev's gone left. Beauty strike that, Kev. Big, that's plugged as well. Ah! Alright, it's left to him actually, isn't it? Good shot. Go. Go, go. Unlucky. Okay. okay. End of part two. Uh, slightly closer than it was. Join us in part three of the lovely Boothbury Park.